Hello, green-thumbed enthusiasts and plant-loving pals. Welcome back to Plant Do Home and Garden. Today, we're venturing indoors and exploring the realm of hassle-free low-light loving plants. Whether you're living in a snug apartment with limited sunshine or simply searching for forgiving foliage that thrives with minimal fuss, we've got you covered. Dive in with us as we unveil the 10 best indoor plants for low light and easy care. Ready to green up your indoors? Let's get started. Leading our list of easy peasy plants is none other than the evergreen charm, Lucky Bamboo. Contrary to its name, it's not actually bamboo but is highly revered, especially in Asian cultures, for bringing good fortune and positive energy. With its slender and segmented stalks, often artfully intertwined, the Lucky Bamboo is a sight to behold. Its versatility allows it to be a centerpiece on your table, a resident of your windowsill, or even a water-bound ornament in decorative vases. One of the standout traits of the Lucky Bamboo is its adaptability. While it does appreciate indirect sunlight, it's no stranger to thriving in low-light conditions, even under artificial lights. Just ensure it gets consistent water, and it will reward you with its evergreen beauty. Sliding into our second spot is the delightful spider plant. Aptly named, this beauty captures the essence of nature's patterns in the most charming way. What truly sets the spider plant apart is its unique growth pattern. The star-shaped flowers eventually give birth to green offshoots, or spiderettes as they're fondly called. These dangle down, mimicking spiders gracefully descending from their webs. The long, slender, green leaves of the parent plant provide a verdant stage for this captivating performance. For those with an affinity for hanging or trailing plants, the spider plant is a match made in botanical heaven. Its resilience is commendable, managing to thrive in varying light conditions, even under artificial luminance. And while it's easygoing, do remember to quench its thirst regularly, preventing the soil from becoming too parched. Introducing the third gem in our list, the resilient and ever-charming golden pothos. This verdant wonder is often the silent hero of many interiors, gracefully adoring spaces where few others dare to grow. The allure of the golden pothos lies in its seemingly simple yet striking appearance. Smooth, heart-shaped leaves, often kissed with a unique marbling of gold, cascade down in a celebration of nature's artistry. The rope-like stems, carrying these leafy jewels, bring a touch of the wild indoors. Golden pothos' fame isn't just for its looks. Its tenacity to thrive in challenging conditions be it dim corners or the occasional forgetfulness in watering, makes it a favorite among plant enthusiasts. While it's undoubtedly low maintenance, a gentle dusting now and then keeps the vines vibrant. And for those who like a neat appearance, a timely trim ensures its elegance remains untangled. A word of caution to our pet parents, while the golden pothos is a treat for our eyes, it's best kept out of reach of our furry friends as it carries a toxic trait. Ascending to our fourth spot, we have the indomitable snake plant, a botanical masterpiece that effortlessly melds strength with style. Hailing from the Sansevieria species, the snake plant, or as some cheekily refer to it, the mother-in-law's tongue boasts robust, sword-like leaves. These green blades can soar up to eight feet, making it a magnificent vertical element in any indoor space. A true champion of resilience, the snake plant asks little but gives much. While it basks in the soft embrace of partial shade, it's no stranger to thriving in more muted light. But here's a tip for those new to the snake plant family, while it's forgiving, it does have a pet peeve, overwatering. Ensure you keep its roots dry and happy to witness it thrive for decades. For our beloved pet owners, a word of caution. While the snake plant stands tall and enchanting to us, it's best to place it out of paw's reach as its allure is coupled with toxicity for our furry companions. Venturing to our fifth entrant, we journey into the enchanting world of the staghorn fern, a plant that breaks conventions embodying both art and nature in its unique form. Epiphytic in nature, staghorn ferns don't conform to the usual soil-rooted existence. Instead, they prefer to grow upon other plants, drawing sustenance in their own remarkable way. Their signature green fronds, mimicking the majestic antlers of a stag, stand out, lending spaces an unparalleled organic elegance. In our homes, the staghorn fern transforms into a living masterpiece. Mounted on wooden boards, it blurs the lines between botany and art, creating a green spectacle that never ceases to amaze. But while they're high on style, staghorn ferns have simple demands. Nestle them in shady havens, shield them from the harshness of direct sunlight, 
and ensure they get a good drink, but remember, just like us, they prefer to dry out a bit between sips. Swaying into our sixth position, we find ourselves enchanted by the classic elegance of the English ivy, or as botanists would call it, heterohelix. Many might recognize this green beauty as an outdoor spreader, blanketing landscapes with its verdant touch. Yet indoors, it adopts a different persona, transforming into a graceful trailer, adding charm with its petite and delicate green leaves. To ensure your English ivy thrives indoors, offer it a stage bathed in indirect light. Like many of us, it enjoys a gentle misting, ensuring it's surrounded by just the right hint of humidity. And come nightfall, it appreciates a cooler embrace, ideally hovering around 60 degrees Fahrenheit. While its beauty is undeniable, a word of caution is in order. The English ivy carries a toxic trait, making it essential to place it thoughtfully, especially if you share your abode with curious pets or young ones. Marching into the seventh spot with unyielding grace, we present the cast iron plant, a botanical embodiment of strength and elegance. This green marvel isn't named cast iron for nothing. Renowned for its rugged durability, it boasts large, arching deep green leaves that gleam with a glossy finish, adding a touch of luxe to any space. The cast iron plant's reputation precedes it, known to withstand bouts of neglect, be it scant light or water. However, a little love goes a long way. Touch the soil, and when it whispers dreaminess to your fingers, quench its thirst. While it's forgiving, direct sunlight can scorch its majestic leaves. A shady nook or a north-facing window would be its ideal sunbathing spot. Elegantly gracing our eighth position is the ever-enchanting peace lily, a plant that embodies serenity and simplicity in every leaf and bloom. Beloved by many for its understated charm, the peace lily doesn't demand the limelight but effortlessly captures it. Its deep green foliage sets the stage for the occasional appearance of its signature white blooms, which stand as symbols of purity and peace. While the peace lily is no stranger to low-light settings and moments of neglect, it does send out a silent plea for hydration. When its leaves droop in thirst, a generous drink rejuvenates its spirit, bringing it back to life. An indirect kiss of light, away from the harshness of direct rays, ensures it continues to bless spaces with its calming presence. A note to our nurturing caregivers out there, while the peace lily offers tranquility to spaces, it's best placed out of reach of curious little hands and paws, as its beauty comes with a toxic touch. Stepping confidently into our ninth spot is the ZZ plant, the quintessential choice for modern living and working spaces. One glance and it's unmistakable. The ZZ plant makes a statement without uttering a word. Its leaves, glossy and broad, seem almost sculpted as they stretch upwards, reaching for greater heights. But don't let its polished appearance fool you. Beneath that shine lies a heart of resilience. From bright living rooms to windowless office cubicles, the ZZ plant's adaptability is second to none. Though it's no stranger to drought and can go without water for a while, remember to quench its thirst occasionally but let it bask in the dryness between sips. While its presence breathes life into spaces, it's vital to note that the ZZ plant carries a toxic edge. Ensure it stands tall but out of the curious reach of kids and pets. Rounding off our top 10 list with a burst of tropical allure is the Anthurium. This radiant beauty, often referred to as the flamingo flower, promises to whisk you away to an exotic paradise with every glance. The Anthurium's charisma lies in its vibrant blooms, which stand out amidst a sea of green. Complemented by lush foliage, it's a botanical masterpiece that's reminiscent of sun-soaked tropical getaways. To keep this tropical gem flourishing, it craves a setting bathed in bright, indirect light. Direct sun rays can be a tad too harsh, causing its leaves to protest with burns. Its roots yearn for a drink in consistently moist soil, but remember, while it enjoys humidity, it's no fan of a soggy bed. Captivating as it may be, the anthurium also possesses a toxic side. Ensure its vibrant allure remains a visual treat and stays clear of the hands and paws of your curious loved ones. As we draw this botanical journey to a close, we're reminded of the incredible diversity and resilience that nature gives us. Each plant, with its unique story and essence, has the power to transform our spaces, offering a touch of serenity, vitality, and beauty. Thank you for joining us on this verdant voyage. Until next time, keep nurturing, keep growing, and always stay rooted in nature's embrace.